the fall equinox tomorrow and it is the most powerful one we've ever had. This is vital that you are strong today, tomorrow, yesterday, and for the next 45 to 60 days going forward. The ascension that if you're into spirituality, you would be hearing about a lot, or you've been hearing about the awakening. It's literally now. We've been preparing and talking about it for, I mean, some people have been talking about it for decades, but it's been really strong for the last year. But right now, we are in an entirely new junction of this awakening, of this ascension, where the sun is literally actively involved and shooting down extreme amount of, like that's scientifically proven, they can see this. This isn't just spiritual woo-woo. They are shooting down rays at us. And the rays, and this is where you have to bring in some faith, the rays are coming through our body. And if you are positive, positively oriented person, these rays are going to be good for you. They are going to do you a favor. They are going to be amazing. But if you are negative, this is when the split happens. If you are negatively oriented, you're going to a negative world, a negative path. You don't want that. You want to pull out all the stops. I am, this is a confession, I am obsessed with spirituality. I'm obsessed with awakening. However, I have a traumatic past and that traumatic past is coming up all the time, right? It's what you do, shadow work. You work with it all the time. But what do you do in a period like this where you can't afford to be negative? You can't afford to have a bad attitude, especially all day. You need to supplement with something to make you happy. So um, people are doing ayahuasca trips. That's a whole thing. That'd probably be the best thing to do. I haven't had the chance to do that one yet, but I trust that it sounds great. But we have other things available to us like cannabis and all its many forms if you're lucky enough to be in Canada it's legal if you're lucky enough to be in lots of the states it's legal but you don't need to go actually like smoke a joint you can get edibles you can get just CBD if you don't want the THC you can get there, there's CBG there's CBN now they now that they're that's one thing we're genetically modifying is good but that's a whole nother topic for another day you want to find something to calm you down and cannabis will do it you also uh, can go and microdose with psilocybin. There's websites now that sell uh, like microdosing pills and they're amazing. There's this, this Euphoria brand you can find on a lot of sites that's really good for you. And that's working its way to being legal and it absolutely should be legal and it used to be legal and it used to be medically studied until the government wanted to come after the hippies. That's when they started the drug on war. It was actually about the hippies, but that's a whole nother topic. We are talking about things that can calm you down. There is other supplements that will naturally do it, like magnesium and um, not ayahuasca. There's another thing that sounds just like it that will also calm you down. Hopefully I remember by the end of the video, but magnesium is helpful. Psilocybin is helpful. Cannabis is helpful. And these are the things you need to bring into your body so that you can be calm because you have to be calm and you have to be positive. If you could be filled with joy and bliss, all the better. You want to, the David Hawking's um, vibratory rate levels. We, you want to be 500 and higher. You want to be 500 and higher. That's not easy. You want to be living in gratitude. You want to be living in bliss. You want to be living in joy. You want to be living in excitement. Easier said than done. I know. That's why we're supplementing because you do not want to miss this equinox energy. And you're not going to miss it either way. You don't want to miss the positive effects that can happen. If you are negative, you will get the negative effects and you really don't want that. We might be talking life and death right now. So you really, really, really want to pull out all the stops and become as positive as possible, as grateful as possible, and genuinely feel it inside you, not fake smiling, oh, that's great. No, you actually need to feel calm, secure, at peace. So do it all, you can do it, I believe in you, good luck.